But y'all, well, we are getting wild this morning. Cody Breland from Wild Acres is joining us with an armadillo, and her name is Peaches. But you wouldn't even know because, I mean, what is this? Like a ball? It's like a coconut. <laughs> so this right here is a Brazilian three-banded armadillo. This girl right here is six years old. This is the only type of armadillo that can completely curl up into a ball, kind of like a roly-poly. Um, but, you know, they have this um, layer of keratin. So they're safe from predators. They oh. don't usually burrow. They'll ball up like this and sleep under bushes and things like that in the rainforest. I, I have to hold you her. Can, can I actually hold her? You sure can. Okay. Just here like we are, so. Carrie. Is this like Raya? Ooh, I can see a little hair. Um, oh, it does. It feels like a coconut. Oh, and you got to hold her on both sides. He was yeah, telling me. Here. Yes, and like listen to this. You hear that? So that's the same as your this and that's keratin, keratin, just like your fingernails. Oh, okay. And now she's a baby, right? She's six years old, six so years she old. just is very small. And this is the, well, no, that's four bands, I guess. If I was going to say, this is the three bands. Or so cool. Yes, so you can see the three bands. And if you want, I actually can mm -hmm. lower her down. Okay. And there is a trick. Ooh, I can smell As soon smell as she goes her. down oh. like this, she, she does have an odor. Ooh, yes, yeah, she she's will open odorous. up. <laughs> And you can actually see she's starting to open up right here. Here she comes. Oh. There is actually something in there. Oh, look, she sees some food on the couch. She's got her little high heels. Oh, look at look at <laughs> peaches. That is the coolest animal. Well, hey, sweetheart. So you're saying that um, that peaches is part of a hands-on um, I guess tour that you have going on right now at Wild Acres. She is a part of our Babies of the Wild experience at Wild Acres. So people, when they book the Babies of the Wild, that includes the sloths, the oh. armadillos, the fennec fox, and um, the kinkajous, and uh, um, baby African crested porcupine that came here, um, um, Quiliana that came a while back. She's actually part of that as well. But um, these smaller animals are a part of that experience. People actually get to um, come in and kind of assist and see, you know, how it is when we care for the smaller animals at Wild Acres. Oh, now, wow. uh, now she's kind of shaking right now. Is, is she scared? She was wanting my um, pinky. She was wanting oh. to hold on to my pinky. Now, does she bite? <laughs> no, so she does not bite. Um, she does have teeth in the back of her mouth, um, but her mouth is pretty small. So what they do is they get bugs in their mouths and they get them back there in the back and chew them up. I was going to say, so, what do they eat? bugs and vegetation. Now, did they um, burrow like as So these okay. these she'll burrow down into like bedding and substrate, but these don't dig large burrows like okay. other armadillos okay. would. These tend to actually um, ball up for their um, safety. So what they do is they'll ball up and they'll get underneath like a shrub or a bush in the wild. Okay. That so is so cool. When are y'all open? We're open Wednesday through Sunday by appointment, okay. except for our events. So, you know, we have the Mammals and Mimosas, Wine Safaris, Family Movie Nights, Pancakes with the Grinch is going on. We have oh, fun. more tickets being released for that um, in the upcoming weeks. Um, more, more event dates are going to be posted. And now these ticket prices, I do want people to know, Cody, that I mean, they're going to help you run this. I mean, that cost a lot to feed them, to keep up this farm, to pay for your volunteers and employees. Yes. And that is how we fund the entire operation is by these private experiences and people coming out. And, you know, we try to keep it private just because a lot of these animals have, you know, kind of complex backstories. So we like to um, keep the crowds to a minimum. We don't like to really overcrowd the animals or do anything too crazy. We like it to be kind of quiet and intimate for families and the animals both. Wow, we could show, you know, Cody loves these animals. This is okay. part of his family, and we always love it when you come on. This is a true transformer I right know. here. Transformer Peaches. in real life. <laughs> Reminds me of Raya from um, the Disney movie, oh, Raya, yeah. the little, the the little armadillo yeah. that rolls. As you can see, I she's foraging that. on my wrist. Look right at now. her. So <laughs> this is like, great. She's trying to get a bug off of you. Well, you can meet her in person, too. That's Just right. To Wild Acres. That's right. And it is chilly this morning, so definitely a big temperature change as you get out this morning morning you'll want to bundle up we'll have a look at your full forecast coming up right up